Yo, what's up guys? This is Theo here. Welcome back to Introduction to C++. This is part 39. Uh, we're going to take the module 4 quiz. So which function always begins C++ programs? Okay, that's the main function, the main method. Um, type in a code to declare a function print it, which prints I love C++ to the screen. Okay, so uh, here we have int main. It's going to call print it, and we're going to invoke this function, and it's going to return 0. Awesome. Type in the missing parameter type of the function, taking an integer value and printing it to the screen. Okay, I'm just going to take an integer. So we got that, you know, um, little uh, inference from up here. Uh, type in the code to declare a function sum, taking three parameters of the type double and returning their sum. Okay, so double x, double y, double z. And we just want to return it. Okay, and finally, we want to print out this function with a, b, and c. Awesome. Type in a code to declare a function, my function, taking two int parameters, okay? And uh, we want to print the multiplication, so with this. Uh, what did I do wrong? Hold on, let me see. Oh, my bad. Let me go back. So I actually need to call it int, what the heck? Int b, oh, sorry. I don't know what I'm thinking. Equals two, and then multiplication. All right. Uh, type in the missing parts of the function calc sum, which takes an array and its size as parameters. And the function calculates the sum of the array elements and prints it to the screen. So let's go through this for loop, and we'll grab um, r of x, and then we'll print out the sum at the very end. All right, guys, cool. So that was it for part 39. Next up, we'll, move, we'll be moving on to classes and objects. So, um, yeah, guys, I'll see you in the next tutorial. So thanks for watching, and have a great day. Take care.